Good morning, everyone. My name is Miss Elisa, and I'd like to say thank you for joining us this morning for Musical Explorers. We're really excited to have you. We're just about to start the show, but before we do, I'd like to warm us up a little bit. And parents and kids, this is for everybody. So take a look at the pictures on the screen behind me, and we're going we're gonna to practice our patterns. So dog, cat, dog, cat. cat, good, all right, here's the next one. Blue, red, green, blue, red, green. All right, I got a couple really loud voices in the front row. I love it. Okay, one more, a little bit harder. Circle, circle, square, square, triangle. triangle. You guys are ready to go. Okay, we got our patterns warmed up. Now it's time to warm up our voices a little bit because this show is all about singing and moving along. So I'm going to trace a a melody with my hand. And when my hand is really low, I want your voice to be really, really low. And when it's really, really high, I want your voice to be really, really high. Okay? Think you can all do that with me? Okay. So, here we go. Good job. Really good job. That was great. Okay. One more thing, some of you may have learned part of the Musical Explorers song in the lobby, but I want to review it as a group. So repeat after me and do what I do. You ready? Okay. I can sing it. Now you. I can sing it. Good. I can say it. I can say it. I can dance it. I can dance it. I can play it. I can play it. Think you got it? Let's try it one more time straight through. No repeating, okay? So I can sing it, say it, dance it, play it. Ready? I can sing it. I can say it. I can dance it. I can play it. I think you're ready for the show. What do you think? Okay. Please help me welcome Miss Shanna and the Musical Explorers song. everyone. My name is Miss Shanna and I'm your host for today's concert. So when you come to a Musical Explorers concert, you become ex an explorer of music and cultures from all over the world. Are you ready to be a Musical Explorer today? Fantastic. Now before we can start, I have a question for you all. How many of you have parents or grandparents that have come to Los Angeles from another country. Raise your hand, let's see. Yes, you, right here, which country? Which one? Louder? Thailand, wow, and yes, right here. Berkeley. <laughs> Not quite another country, but pretty close, right? And yes, my friend, right here. From Russia? Wow! So as you can see, we are a very diverse group. We have families that have come from all over the world, just like the artists that you're going to meet today. 
But now they live in Los Angeles, and they've brought with them their music and their languages to the Broad stage to help us answer a big musical question, which is, how can we play with musical patterns? Can you all ask that with me? How can we play with musical patterns? Okay, are we ready for the show to start? I think so. So our first singer comes to us from West Hollywood. Let's put our hands together and welcome Jesse. Blue skies smiling at me. Nothing but blue skies do I see. Good morning, Jesse. Good morning, Miss Shanna. It's so good to have you with us today. It's so good to be here. Can you tell us what the name of that song was that you were just singing? It's a song called Blue Skies by Irving Berlin, and it's one of my favorite standards. So as a jazz singer, you must know a lot of different songs, but I want to know what is the very first song you ever performed? The very first song I ever performed is a song called Crazy, written by Willie Nelson, but made very famous by Patsy Cline. And I used to sing it in my grandmother's basement with my sister and brother. Oh, that's so nice. How many of you have ever sung a song for your family or friends? Wow, Jesse, we have a lot of singers out there. So I think that we can all be a jazz singer with you today. So I noticed in Blue Skies that your notes or your pitches, they started low, and then they went up, and then they went back down again. Can we all practice that? Can we, everyone take out their fingers, and we're gonna trace those pitches. So let's have Jesse sing, and we're gonna trace along. Blue skies smiling at me, nothing but blue skies do I see. Can we try it one more time and this time maybe sing along with Jesse? Let's try it. Blue skies smiling at me, nothing but blue skies do I see. Fantastic, I think we're ready. Let's all perform Blue Skies with Jesse and let's trace those pitches. Shepherd on the bass. I never 
saw the sun shining so bright Never saw things going so right Noticing the days hurrying by When you love by how they flames Blue days, all of them gone And nothing but blue skies From now on and Nothing but blue skies that was beautiful, Jesse. Thank you. Thank you so much, and great job, boys and girls, tracing the highs and low pitches. And now we can add the word pitch to our word wall as a way that we can play with musical patterns. Are you ready to meet our next singer? He comes to us from Echo Park and brings with him the music of Cuba. Let's all put our hands together for Gabriel. Well, hi there, Gabriel. Hello. So tell me a little bit about the band you brought with you today and the type of music that you sing. Well, my band's name is Changui Majadero, and we play a traditional Cuban music from the region of Guantanamo, Cuba. And what was the song that you started to play as you came on out? The song's called Guarare. Guarare. Is there a part that we can sing along with? Yes, um, you guys can sing the chorus. It's, uh, it's Guarare. Can you guys say Guarare with me? Guarare. Guarare. Good job. So it goes like this. Let's try that. Sing it out. Good job. Looks like they have it. Yeah. So let's all sing along in this next song, Pastora de Guarare, and watch me for when to come in. Pastorita tiene guarare conmigo. Yo no sé por qué será. Pastorita tiene guarare conmigo. Yo no sé por qué será. Yo nunca le Thank you. Are you ready to meet our last singer? 
Her family is originally from India, but now she's coming from Artesia. Let's all welcome Varshini. beautiful song. Thank you. So it sounded familiar to me, but I don't know what language it was in. Can you tell us about it? Sure. In classical Carnatic music, we sing in several different languages. The language I was singing in was called Telugu. And Carnatic music, what is that? Carnatic music is the traditional music of southern India. Oh, okay. So I also heard you singing some really beautiful scale patterns in there. Are they also from southern India? Yes, absolutely. I can show you. That would be great. Sure. Let's all try to sing that together. Fantastic job, everyone. You know, Western music has a scale as well, and it sounds like this. Do, re, mi, fa, so, la, ti, do. It sounds like you guys already know that scale. Let's sing that one one more time. Do, re, mi, fa, so, la, ti, do. Fantastic. So we can add the word scales as yet another way that we can play with musical patterns. And you know, scales are so important to musicians because it helps us learn new songs. Hey, I do that sometimes. You do, Jesse? Me, 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 fa, me, 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 re, 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 do, do. 
exactly like that. And what is the name of that song? It's called Bye Bye Black, but would you like us to sing, uh, play it for you? We would love it. So let's all listen to Jessie and her band sing Bye Bye Blackbird and feel free to sway along.
Thank you. Thank you so much, Jesse. Thank you. So I noticed that during that song, my body really wanted to sway back and forth. I, I really wanted to move. And Gabrielle, I think in our next song, we can really get a move on. Is that right? That's right. Everyone here could uh, dance the cha-cha-cha to this next song. The cha-cha-cha. Excellent. So I think that I have some special helpers to come up on stage and help me lead the cha-cha-cha. And as they're coming up on stage, I want everyone to quietly stand up in front of their seats. Because we're all going to help Gabriel cha-cha-cha. Come on over here, my friends. And what's your name? Sophia. Everyone say, hello, Sophia. Hello, and who's this? Hey, Deanna. Hey. Oh, and stay right here next to me. And what's your name? Mia. Hi, Mia. Hi, Mia. And Joaquin. Hello, Joaquin. Hello, Joaquin. OK, so to do the cha-cha-cha, what we need to do is move our feet in a pattern of alternating fast and slow steps, like this. Step, step. March, march, march. Step, step, march, march, march. Step, step, cha, cha, cha. Step, step, cha, cha, cha. Excellent. I think we have it. So everyone really listen and watch me because our next song goes a little bit faster. So let's all sing and dance along to Guantanamera. For sure, I am out of breath after all that cha cha cha. So let's take a deep breath in through our nose and out through our mouth. Let's take one more deep breath in 
and out through our mouth. And I think we can all agree that doing the cha-cha-cha is another fun way to explore musical patterns. So let's add dance to our word wall. So now I'd like to explore some rhythmic patterns. And Varshini, I think you're the perfect artist to help us with that. Do you have a rhythmic pattern to share with us? Absolutely. In classical Carnatic music, we have several. My favorite is called Adi Thalam. Adi Thalam. Can we all say that together? Adi Thalam. And how do you perform the Adi Thalam? I can show you. Great. Pinky, wind, middle, clap, turn, clap, and turn. Wow, okay, let's break that down a little bit. So let's start with the tricky part first. So everyone take their hands out like this. And we're gonna to touch our pinky to our thumb. And then we're gonna release that, open that. Then we're gonna to touch our ring finger to our thumb and open that. And then we're gonna take our middle finger and touch that to our thumb and then release that. Okay, so that's the trickier part. I'm gonna start the whole pattern for you and you can join in when you feel comfortable, but we'll do it a couple times. So we start with a clap, and then we go to pinky, ring, middle, clap, open, clap, open. And then we're gonna start the pattern again. Let's try it again. Clap, pinky, ring, middle, clap, open, clap, open. Let's do it faster, just a little bit faster. One more time. Ready, here we go. Clap, pinky, ring, middle, clap, open, clap, open. Perfect, you got it. So we're gonna have Barshini start this next song and then watch me for when to start the Adi Thalam rhythm. Take it away, Barshini.
Thank you so much, Farshini. An excellent job keeping that rhythm pattern going. So now we can add Adi Talam to our word wall. So, Gabriel, do you have rhythmic patterns in Cuban music? Yes, we have a lot of rhythmic patterns in Cuban music. As a matter of fact, our, our percussionist here, Alfred Ortiz, plays all the rhythmic patterns. Fantastic. So, Alfred's going to perform some of these rhythmic patterns, and I'm going to find some places on my body to share those rhythmic patterns with you, and I want you to watch me and follow along. So let's hear the first instrument. Okay, so the first instrument are the conga drums, and it goes like this. Excellent, you got that conga pattern down. Great job. The next instrument is the guido. Uh, okay, and we're gonna show you the guido. It's this uh, loaf of bread looking thing right here. And uh, we're gonna use our arm as a guido while he plays it. Fantastic. And the next instrument is the claves. Can you hold up the claves? It's these two wooden sticks. And let's listen to the pattern once, and then we'll clap it. Let's listen first. Great job, everyone. So, Alfred, can you play all of those instruments at the same time? <laughs> well, good news. We can all help you. So during this next song, let's all help Alfred keep those rhythm patterns going. So watch me for those rhythms as we listen to Son de la Loma. Oh, oh. 
Patterns. So let's add rhythm to our word wall. So I'm curious, we have rhythmic patterns in Indian music, and we have rhythm patterns in Cuban music. So Jesse, are there rhythmic patterns in jazz music? Definitely. Zach plays our percussion for us, and he uses lots of patterns. For example, there's this one. Ooh, cool. And there's this one. And there's even this one. All right, Zach. Very cool. Thank you, Zach. syllables to sound like an instrument and make musical patterns. Wow, so you were using your voice to make a rhythmic pattern, and Varshini, I think I heard you doing the same thing. That's really neat. Can you teach us how to scat? Sure. Why don't you guys repeat after me? Do, 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 do. Wow, scatting is super cool. Do you have a song that you like to scat in? Sure, I have many. How about we do a Duke Ellington song called It Don't Mean a Thing If It Ain't Got That Swing? Sounds good. So let's all scat along with Jessie as she sings It Don't Mean a Thing. It don't mean a thing, all you got to do is sing. Do a 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 Oh, it makes no difference if it's sweet or hot. Just give that rhythm everything you got. It don't mean a thing if it ain't got the swing. Do a 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 Didn't 
that not only are you an amazing musician, but you also write your own music, is that right? Absolutely. And that sometimes you like to take different styles of music and combine them into one song, is that true? Yes, I often like to write in a style called fusion music. In fact, since we have so many musicians on stage today, would you all like to join in on my composition? Yeah! Oh, yeah. awesome! So how about we all do a fusion thilana? Excellent. And the Adi Talam rhythm will fit in, so watch me when we can add that in.
composition with us, and how fantastic that all the different styles of music could play together on one song. And you all have done a wonderful job learning about these different styles and all the ways that we can play with musical patterns. We traced pitch with Jesse in Blue Skies. Blue skies smiling at me, nothing but blue skies do I see. We learned about Carnatic scales in Brahma Mokate. Brahma Mokate, para Brahma Mokate. We performed dance patterns in Guantanamera. <laughs> we learned an Aritalam rhythm in Kurai Ondromilai. Kurai Ondromilai. We kept the beat with other rhythmic patterns in Son de la Loma. And we played with scat during It Don't Mean a Thing. Do, 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 do. Give yourself a round of applause for all you've learned today about musical patterns. And before we perform our last song, we have to thank all these amazing musicians up here. So let's thank Jesse, our jazz singer. Mike on the piano and the melodica. Benjamin on the upright bass. Deepak on the tabla. Marcini, our traditional Carnatic music singer. Janani on the tambura. Gabriel, our human singer. Alfred on vocals and percussion. And last but not least, Ernesto on baby bass. We're going to perform the Musical Explorer song one last time, but this time our artists are going to come up and invite you to repeat after them and sing in the style of their music, like this. I can sing it, now you. I can sing it, Jesse. I can say it, I can say it. Thank you.